What's going on you guys, yeah, Boy Raider here today. I am back for another Lego video. But before we start, I just want to thank Spencer and Dylan for making me reach 20 subscribers. Now I know that's not a lot, but it's very special to me. And I just want to thank you guys. And um, I said in my Pokemon card video that the next people to subscribe to me will get a Pokemon card pack, so I will be giving Dylan and Spencer a Pokemon card pack, but, um, also go check out Spencer's YouTube channel, it's called Xbox Gaming 5000, um, but, um, the reason you guys came here was to check out this very, very fun but hard set that I've been working on for the past three days, it is the Lego Technic McLaren Senna GTR. Now, you guys have seen this um, in my video where I said that I bought some new toys to review for you guys today at some stores. Um, but I finally completed building it, and I'm going to review it today. It is set 42123. Yeah, I said that right. Uh, it ages 10 and up, and it uh, has 830 pieces. Just look at that beauty. Let's check out the back. Here's some, just shows you the play features. And it says that this is 32 centimeters, so it is 12 inches and a foot, It's uh, so it's a foot long. Um, but yeah, there's some of the play features. Um, but here is the completed build. Not on the box, but actually built of Legos. This thing was very fun, but like I said, it was very hard to build. So if you want a challenge and you have $60, go to the store, get this set. It's a good challenge, um, and it's also a good collector piece once it's done. Um, but without further ado, let me show you everything that this car has to offer. So let's check out the front first. It can kind of open a little bit. I don't think it's supposed to. But um, it has this like cool front section that's pretty interesting to build. Um, but one downfall about this set, though, it has tons of stickers, like tons. Like, look how much are just on the front there. All those designs you see, those are all stickers. And then there's a bunch of stickers on the sides and on the back there and on this side. There's a lot of stickers in the set. Um, but that's what make this. That's what makes this set. This set, sorry. Um, but let me show you some of the play features. Um, of course, like every other Lego Technic set, they got this pin up top, and that pin allows the wheels to move and this just allows it if it's on a surface it can go side to side and that's always a fun play fee for <laughs> play feature for kids um, just having that little play feature changes the whole set uh, but another play feature is you can kind of see it a little bit better down there but I'll show it from the top um, but if you turn these wheels, you can kind of see those little things spinning right there. Well, those, when the wheels are turning, those will push up these little yellow axles, which kind of represent the engine, like a part in the engine. And here, let me show you. You can kind of see them going up and down in there. And those are because each and every one of those are pushing up and down and going up and down. On those axles when this wheel is moving, you kind of see the gear right there. Just look at the bottom. I showed this in the Jeep too. This, look at how complex and just look at how, you can just see the amount of pieces and how complex this was. Just from looking at the bottom, and then of course the wheel mechanism, which has a rod that goes all the way up and connects to the to the pin up here that turns the wheels. And this can also I mean this not this can also this also has doors that slide straight up and open like the real car the real car is really cool I haven't seen it I've just seen pictures um, but there's also a steering wheel and some seats in there and there's actually like some bendable pieces too that make up the uh, that make up the pretty much the whole front section like the whole what is it, like the cockpit <laughs> section? Um, it's like these bendable rods that you have to connect. And I thought that was really cool to include those in the set. Um, and there's some big pieces up here. And there's some small, really small pieces because it's Lego Technic. Um, 
This took me about three days to build. Um, like I said, eight. How much pieces is this? Eight hundred and thirty. Um, so if you guys want a challenge, but you also want an enjoyable build, and you have sixty dollars, go buy this set. I suggest. I also just suggest the Jeep Wrangler. Jeez, I can't speak today. Um, the Jeep Wrangler, because that was also a very fun set to build. But, uh, the next video I'm going to be making is a review on the Lego Shang-Chi Dragon. So, if you don't want to miss that video and be one of the first people to watch that video, then I suggest you guys subscribe right now, um, and ring that bell, because if you ring that bell, then you'll get a notification when that video comes out, and you can be one of the first people to see it. And also, like. Like, like, like. Um... Um, but otherwise, thank you again to Spencer and Dylan for making me reach 20 subscribers. I will give you guys your Pokemon cards, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.